What is up, crawler fans, RC enthusiasts, and social media surfers? I'm your boy Josh with Texoma RC, and we are looking at the Slayer Basic Kit, right? This is actually the Slayer Basic Raider right here. It comes with the red struts and the red link riser. So that's right, the Slayer Basic Kit in Slayer Basic Raider. Here we go, dude. What do we got on the table? We have the rails struts with a strut cross we have the rear link riser we have the cool little cute star grommets for the hood the c10 body mounts with the front body clip and the body clip adapter for the c10 we have an adapter for the power wagon this was the original power wagon rear cab mount to the bed we have an adapter here that works and screws into the holes for the rear cage. So if you wanted to leave your uh, your roll bar on the back, you could and screw up into it, or you could put screws down through there. So I'm not gonna spend a ton of time setting the car up on camera. We're gonna go ahead and get it built, but we are gonna be swapping out this Gladiator. Right now it looks like we don't even have rear springs. I'll be putting springs on here. We're not gonna be running that uh, nonsense. Um, so we will be uh, getting this thing going. Looks like we do have a little bit of brass, so it's not exactly a stock, stock swap, but this is an average gladiator, you know, something to take out, be good little fun. So we're going to take this and make this into a Slayer with body. So we're going to show it off with the multiple body options. So what are we going to need to complete our Slayer build? We are going to need an axle, links, shocks, servo, transmission with a motor, the four long screws to connect the lower links to the transmission skid. You got to get that done before you get started. Swap out that rear link riser and let's get to it. If you want to see the car built, check out the video with the thumbnail, build it, and you can see the cage slayer being swapped over to a C10, and you can see the whole build process. This is going to go together just the same, other than a few minor changes with the bed connecting. We will demonstrate that. Let's get to it. That looks tough. Oh my gosh, look at it, dude. Dude, we don't have a body map for it. Stay tuned because we will. Check it out. Oh my gosh, dude. You gotta keep it Slayer Raider. All right, dude, this thing is so dope. We're not running any rubber bands or anything yet. Check it out, watch this. Boom. Look at that cut, dude. Holy smokes. Ah, we gotta get the gladiator going, but check that out. Dude, <laughs> look at that, dude. <laughs> ah, dude, the front axle on Doug's a little bit uh, farther out just with the FMS axles, so. But dude, look at that. Just mounts right on. Same thing. Just glue your magnets in. So, quick note, the strut holes here line up with the first hole through the fifth hole. Just a key note on that. Other than that, man, everything goes together super good. You can put screws in here. Man, I had the idea you could maybe like run multiple screws in here, or you could do the same thing up here. Pretty cool. I just think it would look, look kind of neat to see like a bolt pattern right down through there. Pretty cool. Or maybe again, something like over here. I'll have to do that and show it off. Not going to do that right now, dude. We're going to put this thing on the rocks. I am so excited. Look at this thing. I am so excited. Nothing crazy, dude. Oh my gosh, let's freaking do it. So check it out. What did we do? First off, with the body, 60, 40. It says 54, 46, but we'll flip it around. 60, 40, 52, 48. So we should be about 50, 50, 60, 40 front to back. Two runs coming up, dude. Freaking Slayer Raider. Slayer Raider coming at ya. Here we go, dude. We got the Slayer freaking basic on the rocks, dude. Let's go. Wow, these electronics are dope. These are better than the freaking V2 electronics. Oh, yeah, we swapped the servo for the FMS. It is way better. So these are stock. FCX24 electronics with, look at it go. That's an 030 motor, stock motor. That is so dope, dude. Look at, I let off too much. I was trying to show off. Look at that. Oh my gosh, bro. Are you kidding right now? Look at this thing. We're going slow, dude. We don't have to. This thing is dope. This thing is dope. 
And now we do have a little bit of brass in comparison to the old, uh, from the last video, the actual stock swap. But look at this thing go. It's got a body on it, not just a cage. Oh, look at the snappiness of that. Oh my gosh. Look at this. So good. Let's keep it going. This is too good. I haven't driven, dude. This is freaking rad. Look at that. Wow. Come on. Whoa. Uh, rip tail flip. All right, dude, so the range was a piece of cake, but that should make sense. We're freaking super low on a Slayer with good traction. But what happens if when we come over here in a loose rock section? Let's go. <laughs> what happens, dude? What happens in the loose rocks, dude? Are we too low for the loose rocks? You tell me, dog. And we got tiny ass little tires. Come on, buddy. Uh -oh. Let's go, buddy. Come on. Hold on. I got it. Oh, I'll rip till you flip. One more, dude. One more. One more. That was me, dude. I had it, and then I freaking messed it up. Let's see, dude. This is what's one of those things I always come over here to try. This is how I set up my skid, actually. It was right here on this section and another section. I'd come out here, I'd make a new version of the rail, or I couldn't even get up there with these tiny little tires. There it is. Still can't get up there, there it goes. There it goes, gee whiz, I had to give it the beans. Not gonna happen. Ah, what do you mean not gonna happen? Just, we didn't crawl up there, dude, but we also only weighed 230 grams, so freaking A, what do you want? Let's go, dude. Come on, buddy. Look at that slow crawl, dude. And the snappiness. This ESC is so good, dude. Look at that. Come on, let's go. Slayer rific guy. Slayer rific guy. Let's go a little more, dude. And then we'll get the other run in here. We're at 230 grams, dude. That's half of Pecker. Oh my gosh, dude. That is half. And we got a body. Uh, and it's half the weight. That blows me away. Can you make that guy? Can you make that right there? Come on. Show me. Show me some love, dog. Ah. Well, we on the wheels. Let's take, keep it going, dude. Keep it going. Keep it going. This is the last one. When we flip over, dude, it's over. Or if we reach the end. Either way, let's see if we can reach the end. Come on. There it is, dude. Come on, buddy. Who makes this, dude? I'm gonna freak out. I'm gonna freak out. Come on, bud. Ah, dude, are you kidding me? We had a little driver mod in there, bro, but come on. Hung up on the rear diff. Come on. We're hanging out over the over the gap, dude. Hanging out. Let's see if we can make that. Come on, dude. This is big boy stuff right here. Ooh, no problem, guy. No freaking problem. Come on, bud. Come on, buddy. 
Look at that servo. It's so freaking good. These are stock parts, bro. Get up there. Easy. Let's go. Cool. Here, you missed that. Back it up. Easy money. You better go up this time, dude. Oh, jeez. There it is. Dude, these electronics are so good. Oh, let's go. Super low, tiny tires, dude. Slayer all the way, dude. Texoma style, bro. This is so freaking sick. New class coming at you, dude. Spec class. We're going to have probably one or two spec classes, dude. Ooh, let's keep it going. Can we make it up this guy? Come on, bud. Oh, I could use some dampening. This is so hard, by the way. There it is. There it is. There it is. Ah, let's go. Ah, oh, let's go, tiny tires, dude. Ah, uh, might be the end. Might be the end. Let's go, tiny tire, dude. We're coming up on the battery. Oh, there we go. Oh, rip tell you flip. Let's try the other tires. Right, dude, one more freaking run, dude. We got Doug body on here. Freaking looking sick. Let's see if we can do the backwards run, which is way harder than the forward run. Let's go. So, why are we doing another run? Because we went ahead and put that. Gosh, dude. We put that CR18 motor in here. So we have basically the FCX24 or CR18P electronics in here. So it'd be the CR18P electronics uh, servo uh, ESC receiver combo and the motor. We're going to have to see what we can work out, dude, because this is dope. Super cheap Slayer, bro. Freaking crazy good. Crazy good. Let's the shot down there. Crazy good. So we can obviously use overdrive, dude, uh, or underdrive. Under if this motor is not real fast. Dude, that's how you slay, bro. Let's check out the loose rocks, dude. Let's see if it does any better with this motor. Let's see if we can push on this one. I'd say, yeah, we're doing way better, dude. Way freaking better. Oh, let's see if we can do the trick. We're a little long. It's better with the shorty. Rip to flip, homie. No, couldn't do it. Like I said, better with the shorty. And overdrive. Are we still gonna pull it around? All right, let's run this way, dude. A little bit more, dude. Rip till you flip. We flip over, we're done, dude. Make it to the end, we're done. So dope on this setup. I can't tell you how stoked I am. I'm gonna work this out with them, dude. I promise. We're gonna work something out. Cause this is a killer setup, dude. This is what we're gonna be using in the spec class, bro. Oh, so good. Let's go, dude. Uh, film that better. Dude, that was so sick and you missed it.
This thing is so good. Let's say flip, dude. Check them out, bro. All right, so with the Flub RC, tire inserts in the front, the big dished out Enduro tires and wheels, we are at 323.4, this time, let's check it this way. So we went a little far forward with the dug body, but pretty freaking good, let's check it out. All right, so although we have higher clearance issues with these massive tires that we would have to cut the body a little more, we are at 6040 with the C10. A little bit heavy potential one way, but 60-40. Dude, that's freaking awesome, bro. Brass in the rear, brass knuckles, brass on the front, big servo from Hobby Plus or, F or FMS, 050 Hobby Plus motor, FCX24 or CR18P, ESC and battery. Dude, legit right here. This is absolutely legit. Let's see what we can do on a price, dude. We got to be able to offer these for you as kits dude you build this exact car right here this is